Good morning, everyone. Welcome to Athens Christian Reformed Church this morning. I think this is probably the largest number of people we've had to an in-person service in like, yeah, way too long. <laughs> Um, now, mind you, for those of you at home, we are still duly within safety uh, guidelines and so on, just so you're not worried or anything like that. Uh, but it is good to see you all here uh, for sure. It is wonderful to be with you this morning. There are a couple things that I need to announce for you this morning. Uh, first of all, uh, we are having in-person uh, Sunday school and nursery starting today. Uh, Sunday school will be during the, the sermon, basically, uh, and following to the end of the service, and will be for children ages three to five, and uh, nursery is for children younger than that. Uh, <coughs> and again, all protocols will be followed uh, to the absolute best of our ability. Um, there is uh, sad news along with that, uh, and, and that is that, um, and this is not to guilt you at all, but no one actually signed up to do summer Sunday school, not a soul, and, and that's okay, I'm not judging you. It's just that, you know, next Sunday, if there's still nobody signed up, then I may have to take the Lord's word seriously when he says, let the children come unto me, and maybe I will leave and do summer Sunday school, and you can figure out what to do with the service yourself. Huh? So this is more like bribery than it is, or like uh, blackmail than it, is <laughs> than it is like uh, chastisement. So uh, the sign-up sheet is under the mailboxes in the fellowship hall. If any of you are inspired to prevent me from going and teaching Sunday school, uh, by the way, way back when I was 17, some little four or five-year-old kid tugged on my shirt sleeve and said, you're not very good at this, are you? When I... <laughs> when I was teaching Sunday school, so that might be even more reason to get somebody else to do it. Yes? Awesome. So you even will get a package from Wilma uh, to help you out. So if you are feeling inspired to prevent that tragedy, uh, sign up for summer Sunday school. Uh, that would be great. Also this morning, uh, we are uh, preparing for communion. Next week, Lord willing, we will be celebrating communion. And uh, because of uh, COVID and so on, but also because of reopening, we will be providing elements. We will prepare those elements with all due caution and preparation. Uh, however, if you are uncomfortable partaking of the elements that have been prepared by us, you may still bring your own for your own comfort if, if that's what you prefer. So next week, if you are coming to join us for communion, uh, you may partake in the elements that we prepare. Uh, or you may, if you're more comfortable, choose to bring your own. Those are, I believe, all the announcements that I need to make at this time. So I would invite you to stand and receive God's greeting. Welcome, brothers and sisters, in the name of the Lord our God, who has sent his Son to be the Passover Lamb for us all. Welcome in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. We'll invite the praise team forward to lead us in worship at this time. 